Where am I? It's okay. Calm down. Just relax. You're gonna be fine. You're not smarter than you. Achieved our objectives. The man's always gonna be better than machine. Unfortunately, he sustained life-threatening injuries. He's stable, but you got a long way to go. Who are you? It's me, Taylor. I think it's time you woke up, don't you? All right, use your enhanced mobility. It may take a little getting used to, but your confidence will soon grow. Try it for yourself. I got a hunter says you can do it. Not bad, newbie. Not bad. Attack mode will highlight inbound threats such as rockets and grenades. You see flashing red, move.
and I didn't just help us communicate with each other. It allows us to interact with a variety of computer systems, including pretty much all the basic drone units. Now, bipeds, sophisticated ground units, those are a whole lot trickier, brother. Those sons of bitches got a damn hive mind. You try to process and control all that, your brain is toast. But these, these fuckers are easy. Go ahead, hack in. Go see what's on the other side of this wall. Fits like a glove, right? Now somewhere through there is a generator. Take it out and that door should open. Fresh ammo whenever you see an ammo crate. Last thing you want is to be in a fight with no bullets.
Just ahead. Once inside, interface with the central console. Pull any data you can. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just take a second. Take a deep breath in. Tell me what happened. I was back in Ethiopia. The grunts, I, I lived it all again. What's happening to me? You know how your senses can trigger vivid memories? Make you think of sounds, sights, words from songs. Make you think of stuff you haven't thought of in years. The DNI can make that a lot more visceral. Little glitches on your optics, little whispers in your ear. This shit happens. The doctor can straighten it out. You just need to recalibrate your meds. Trust me, you're gonna be fine. So what now? Oh, right now? You're gonna interface with that console. As soon as you plug in, you'll be able to extract and process the information in a heartbeat. Got it. They had a man on the inside at Coalescence. He would have been able to supply them with everything they needed to bypass the security on the train. The botched assault man, it took six hours for the ZSF to get that information. Outcome? Train go boom. Took you just six minutes. Yeah, it would have been five. If you hadn't freaked out when you saw those robots. So what happens now? Now we go find the son of a bitch. Tipped off by his terrorist pals. The mole was ready for him. He had heavy duty combat grunts with him. Once again, the Zerk security force got their asses handed to him. Outcome train go boom. We lost him. He slipped away. You remember Specialist Sarah Hall? She's gonna walk you through the next part. Trust her, do exactly what she says. I trained her myself. She's an intelligence expert from back when that actually meant something. Before DNI, you had to read books. In the Academy, Taylor made me read a lot of them. Well, some knowledge is worth earning, appreciating. And that takes time. Time is something we don't always have. Okay, New Blood. From this point on, the simulation deviates from actual events. Not that it's gonna feel any less real. Use your imagination. Sending his location to your HUD. Come on now, pick up the 
trap. Check your fire. Civilians are not targets. I still have line of sight. Our boy's hacking the CSF talents. What does that tell you? He's running scared. Not sitting behind a computer. He can only be controlling them if he's got a DNI too. You're a smart one, New Blood. I'll give you that. You see where you went wrong? Son of a bitch is still moving. Use that billboard to get over the maglev train. Zurich, move. All right, activating the new cyber ability. System paralysis. Nice going, new blood. Nice going. Your cyber abilities don't come for free. They take a little time to recharge. Keep an eye on your HUD. Out so well, huh? I reckon our suspect has about 15 seconds left before he shakes hands with the Grim Reaper. You can't let that happen. Not before you get the information we need. I don't think he's in any condition to talk. He doesn't have to. He has a DNI. Buried beneath layers of security protocols, the subject's DNI records cam footage of the user's past experiences. In extreme circumstances, it is possible to extract that information by force. You'll be able to push deep into the subject's memories, their thoughts, even their subconscious. You could learn everything we need to know about the terrorist plans. I'm sensing a butt coming up somewhere. You should know. Not only will this procedure be deeply traumatic for the subject, but the associated subconscious interference will leave him brain dead dead. Believe me, this is a bad way to go. <laughs> You're taking heavy fire! That's a backup! ZSF finally tracked down the terrorists to this location. They're sick. They really wish they had. You're still here, huh? Pity. I bet Diaz a hundred that you'd be dead by now. Funny man, Specialist Peter Moretti. He's gonna help you understand how much of a badass motherfucker you are now. But remember, we still don't have the last piece of the puzzle. How in the hell they got the explosives on board the train? So we're clear? When this is over, you owe me a hundred. Back to business. As you know, one of the perks of being Black Ops is having access to the latest in experimental weaponry. Firearms may be your go-to choice for a weapon in a fight. But with DNI, your mind truly is your greatest weapon. Let's do some damage.
Not bad, new blood. They're using smoke grenades. Make a soldier out of you yet. Mm. 
Party ain't over yet. Let's move. I got bots moving that rail car. Shred them. Not bad, new blood. <laughs> Car! 